Good morning. Today is Wednesday, July 27, 2022. I'm Dave Landry, and this is the market in Mexico. Well, peace on a fairly hard yesterday. Now, at the end of the world, this actually puts them right back to the 30 EMA. Also, gives them a little bit of this breakout that they tried so far, though, trying to bottom out in here. But any additional weakness would be concerning. Keep an eye on that 30 EMA. Take a look at the longer term trend. So far, remains down. Shorter term again, trying to bottom out. Ditto for the NASDAQ. Bit of a bummer there, though. It's come all the way back in to its 30. Longer term again, downtrend remains intact. Rusty looks a little bit better. His breakout remains intact. It does have a lot of overhead resistance to deal with. Energy's had an open gap reversal. So far, it looks like that rollover remains intact. So maybe look for shorting opportunities there. Biotech continues to try to buy out, bottom out, but lately it's been kind of choppy. And he does have a lot of overhead resistance. So what do we do? Well, I am seeing some speculative issues coming off of all-time lows that are beginning to look interesting. And obviously on the short side, continue to look at those energies. For the most part, though, you might just want to wait it out. Let's see if this market really can bottom out. Any questions, as usual, Dave at DaveLandry.com. I'm Dave Landry, and you're the market.